Hey guys, my name's Rosie. Thanks so much for dropping by. This video is on my Filofax Holborn pocket rings and how I use it as a wallet and an everyday carry. So let's get this video started. to share with you guys this flip through of how I've been using this wallet uh, for the past couple weeks. I love this thing. I think it's like the perfect pocket rings planner if you want an everyday carry and a wallet all in one. So let's open this up and see how I'm using it. I just love the configurations of this planner. I love that it has three card slots up here and a larger one down here. I don't have my driver's license in here because no matter what angle you put it in or what side you put it in, you can see my driver's license number. Um, so that's where I usually keep my driver's license but don't have it in here right now. I have a bunch of kind of like stamp cards in here for like cookies and <laughs> eyebrow waxes and ice cream so I keep my punch cards in here I don't have anything in this pocket but I'm pretty sure I could just use it for more gift cards or more card zaps and this back pocket here I don't keep anything but I do have a little um, receipt for me to pick up something me and my daughter Annie went to um, a pottery making class so still need to pick that up it's getting glazed right now and then I just keep some coins and McDonald's a Monopoly sticker for free muffin in there in my back pocket I just keep receipts um, and, and some cash I'm really weird I have yet to take this out this is Lauren's hair from her first haircut a couple weeks ago so I put it in my wallet and then um, I transfer it into my planner I still need to put it in Lauren's little memory keeper but I'll have it in there for now so the actual guts of this planner let's get to it so in the front here, I have a running to buy list. These sticky notes are from cloth and paper. And here's a photo of me and my two daughters. I still remember it, it was um, right before their bedtime and we all had double chins and having a good time here. So I just love this photo. In the back here is a photo of me and my husband, some dot stickers from my girlfriend, Kat from the planner community, and a Hello Beautiful card that is an appointment card for my hairdresser. I have some vellum here and behind that I keep this jelly dash. These cards here are from Allergy Designs. It's just a please return to contact card if I lose my planner and in case of emergency. I just love how this jelly dash is right over Lauren's face and then she can see her little cute face peeking through. I have um, page flags here from Staples. In the back here, I have more of those page flags, I mean, sticky notes from cloth and paper, and a sticker here from Notes and Sonder. I have a to-do um, running list kind of like for me to get done. The, these are sticky notes from Poi and Hun, and a friend of mine, and her name's Tom, she made this thick um, vellum dash because I couldn't get a hold of the cloth and paper ones and she made those for me so I really love that. That's my inbox. These inserts are from Poin Han. These are the inbox inserts um, that you get. And here is a Foxy Fix dash with a photo of my girls with Lauren's first Christmas. And in the back here is another photo of Lauren and Annie and more vellum. I just love layering photos with vellum. Since this is my wallet, um, there's not a lot of like deco, like cute characters or quote cards or anything like that. Most of the deco in here are just photos of my kids and my family. Um, so let's get going. Here is my yearly section. This vellum dash is from Mary Glam Plans. I'll make sure to link her Instagram below. It's a freebie that I printed on vellum. This is a year overview um, from Peanuts Planner Co. of 2020. And this is a pullout yearly. This has all of my paydays as well as the days that I have 
off. So I get every other Friday off because I work longer hours um, in the week. So I just have that highlighted here, the days that I have off. They're called the flex days. Um, here is um, the start of the Poi and Han 2021 inserts. So this is a year at a glance on two pages. And then here, I'm still not sure what I'm going to include here, but I'm probably going to put stat holidays and possibly flex days so days that i every other fridays that i have off here's my monthly section a photo of lauren isn't that cute she looks so happy there we were ha having dinner by the ocean um that's when the restaurants first started opening up um ever since covid here's another vellum dash from mary glam plans and it is over this peanuts planner co insert uh with a month that's like a list um version of it and so it gets 1 to 30 and this section has my husband's work calls um he was working those days but because i didn't actually start using this planner until like i think like the 16th or like the 19th um i just didn't bother back planning because I just didn't need to and then here are my calls for the month and then this is next month as well I like to keep um one or two months at a time of this insert especially since we don't know my husband's is in residency right now we don't really know his schedule past like a month or two other than holidays so there's no point of me having like a whole year or half a year of these inserts for him here's another photo of Annie baking that's it lauren was in this photo too but i cropped her out because i just love this photo of annie and then it goes into my monthlies from poi and hun kind of like a 2021 vision board probably going to be more photos of my kids <laughs> and then this is my month on two pages this has a list of all the the points and events and birthdays that I need to know. Um, this wallet, um, everyday carry planner. Um, this is pretty much my lifeline. This is what happened. This is what I would use if my phone died. So I always have this up to date. My phone is constantly dying for some weird reason. I know I should be carrying like a portable battery, but I don't. Um, so I have this, um, in here and I have a whole year in here i love these inserts because they started in october and it goes until the end of 2021 so i love that so convenient here is my family section here's a photo of jamie and lauren together isn't that so cute oh my gosh and uh that was on thanksgiving canadian thanksgiving this year this section is my family section so it has annie's and mine's and the kids like last doctor's appointments flu shots anything like that that's like medical related um we also have a section here for edward as well someone who's last vet and wash i also have a period tracker here again this is a functioning planner as if I didn't lose my, I didn't have my phone with me so if I was in a doctor's office and they're like when was your last period I could just like whip this planner out and like mention okay my last period were these days and then this section here is my, still my family section but these are like my contact sections so this is Jamie's family's contact so it has um his brother and his wife's phone numbers his mom's um number and address and then it goes into my family's as well so my parents phone number and address and my brother's phone number and address in here and then in the back here are um Annie's contact information for her school her horseback riding and her flute lessons and then this this section here has all the important contacts of my friends. So I have around seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven friends with their phone numbers on there, just in case I need to get picked up or something happened. I can't get a hold of like my, my family members and I need someone, someone's help. I have their numbers in here. I also have medical information of like my, my doctor's um, information, our dentist information, as well as like my optometrist information here. And then that's pretty much like all the important contacts that I keep in here. As you can see, there's no passwords in here, um, nothing like that. It's just contacts. Um, this section here is pretty awesome. I love this section. I still have it filled out, have it filled out. It has um, all of Jamie's um, 
like like not weight but kind of like when I'm buying clothes I have his I'll have his weight his height oh I do have his weight I was like not his weight anyways his weight his height his shirt size his collar size sleeve size his sweater size pants waist inseam shoe size and then again myself height weight shirt shoe inseam waist and then Eddie's weight down here that's our dog and then here would be like same with Annie when I'm trying to buy clothes height weight size shoe size again same with Lauren and then this is my miscellaneous um, section. Here's me and Edward. He's a Cavapoo. So his dad is a miniature poodle and his mom is a Cavalier Spaniel. He was not supposed to look like that, but he does. But he's so cute. Anyways, um, here is my makeup information. I always forget it. I don't even wear makeup, but just in case I need it, it's right here. Still need to fill out the books I want to read. I hate going into bookstores and I don't have internet access. I don't know why um, I can't connect to the Wi-Fi or can't connect to um, data. And I'm trying to go through Goodreads and like, what is the name of that book again? And so that's why I made this section. I have an etc section and then I have my latest when, when was the last massage when was the last car when was the last haircut and I also have like a wish list for Jamie of Annie um and then with Lauren I, she doesn't really need a wish list because I know what she likes she likes trucks cars and anything like that um so th this side is empty but yeah this is the actual insert portion of my planner as you can see here fits quite a lot. Um, these rings are 16 millimeter rings. So they're smaller than like the Falifax uh, Malden, but not as small as the um, Louis Vuitton Pima Agenda. I did a review, a comprehensive review of all the pocket planners that I own. You can see, um, I'll link that video down below. And then here are just like my like gift cards and membership cards. Um, I like the this idea here. So with my gift cards, I use this like page flag and I write down how much is on these gift cards. So that's super convenient to have. And this card holder is from Jillio. I have a lot of people who ask me that. And then for the longest time, I didn't know where it's from. But someone told me, hey, you know, those are from Jillio. So now I can finally share you where the, this is from. And then I had these post-its that I cut down to fit onto this um, page lifter. These are just regular post-its. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. Um, that's a quick and um, thorough flip of my fellow Vax molded and how I'm using it. As you can see there's not a lot of deco I mean there's a lot of photos of my kids but um, I try not to put that many quote cards or anything that's unnecessary I just have everything that I need on the go anything that I would need if my phone died so yeah I hope that helps you with some ideas of what to include in your pocket wallet and everyday carry if you enjoyed that video make sure to give it a thumbs up and think about subscribing as well until next time, you guys. Bye.